Griffin. This is made uh, in Woodstock, New York. It's handmade, and it's made by Joe Vayette. I bought it probably about 12, maybe 13 years ago now. And uh, as I said, this one's made in Woodstock. It's made in the United States. If you go to buy one of these now, you can still buy them handmade in the United States. But he has um, uh, a number of them that he's making over in, in China or one of those countries that you can get for a more affordable price. So it's called the Avante. But this is the Griffin, and the Griffin that I have is handmade. And you notice it has kind of a, a mandolin kind of sound. And, uh, and that's because it's tuned uh, D to D instead of E to E, right? Your standard tuning. And it's almost a full octave higher. So it gives you that really high, that really high sound. And it sounds really cool. And the reason why I wanted to show you this today is because um, there's, there's a subscriber and a YouTube creator by the name of Randy Rhythm. I don't know if you have heard him before, but I suggest you go listen to him and subscribe to him. I mean, he's really uh, fun to listen to. Well, he was listening to my channel and he listened to uh, one of my lessons on double drop D. That's probably about three or four lessons back or videos back. I don't know if they're all lessons, but there's about three or four videos back. It's called double drop D. And so he was listening to that and it inspired him. And so he sat down and he started making up his own little tunes around it. And he shared it on, on YouTube again. And so I have it here and actually I have it mic'd on my laptop. And I thought what I would do is play along with it and play along with how he's inspiring me. <laughs> because that's how music works. We inspire each other. People ask me all the time, how did you learn? Well, I left home at a young age and hitchhiked all around the country. And so I got to meet a lot of different people, a lot of different guitar players. And I think probably when my, my greatest learning was playing together with other people and listening to them and trying to play along and learning from them and uh, watching what they do. Um, uh, and really some of the, my best moments playing guitar, I think is playing with others. It always is, it still is. I, I prefer to sit down one-on-one -on -one or two or three people in the room and just, you know, have out an all-out jam session and just enjoy spontaneously playing, coming up with tunes, um, you know, especially around blues or whatever. In this case, it's kind of a, a swampy blues sound. Um, and it's just a lot of fun. But that's how I learn guitar. And so if you're wondering how I learned guitar, I thought I'd demonstrate Yes, I had some classes when I was younger, and yes, in grade school, I took violin. You know, that was when they had uh, music in the schools as part of the education system. Um, and so I, I did have a violin and learned how to play it. But, um, and that's how I learned how to read music. But I think as far as guitar is concerned, um, I learned a lot just by playing with others. And uh, that's what's so wonderful about YouTube because you can listen to what people have and they'll share with you and you can play along with them on it. Um, and also if you have jam sessions in, in your town, if you if you go and you check out, you probably if you search it on, on, the, on the web, you probably find out that you have jam sessions that are happening for the community that people can get together and play. You should check. Um, we have one around here. I haven't been attending it. I uh, should should be going. I feel bad, but I've been so busy. Uh, it's sort of set, been set aside a little bit. But I'll be back to that. It's a lot of fun. But um, so anyways, I thought what I would do is play what Randy came up with after he was inspired by what I shared on my video. And now I'm inspired by him. And I'm going to share those two together. It's, this is how you learn. This is how you have fun. Really, it's it's a lot of fun. Okay, let's give it a try. Okay, here we go. I have this thing mic'd. I'm recording on an iPhone, so it's not the best. This is not a studio by any means. 
Okay, let's give it a try. So there you have it. Thank you, Randy. You made my day. I had so much fun doing that, playing along with you. And uh, I hope you get a whole bunch of people watching you on your channel. You have a great channel and um, it inspires me too. All right, you all have a great day out there. And don't forget, we have a live that's coming up. Actually, it's, on, uh, it's gonna be on Tuesday, Tuesday at 6 p.m. And, um, you know, I, I'm not sure. Well, it'll be California time. So make sure you join us and uh, we'll have a good time. I'll come up with something. And let's see what else we're going to do around here. Um, well, I think that's it. I can't think of anything else. So I hope you have a great day or night wherever you are in this world. Thank you.